Kasi I'm Kathleen May. Uh, I graduated chemical engineer. Mahirap ba yung eh? Uh, oh, mahirap. Pero hindi naman siya impossible. Offered sa Lasal, chemical engineering, civil engineering, mechanical engineering, computer engineering, industrial engineering, manufacturing, and yung mem, electronics engineering. Well, sa chemical engineering, yung myth dyan, it's all about chemistry, but it's a lie. It's not chemistry, it's all about engineering. It's more on designing plans and operations, unit operations. So do you have this? Just listen in class so that you don't have to study a lot when you go And then do homework in advance, do projects in advance so that you don't cramp at the end. Next na kailangan, for chemical engineering, the Bible is Perry's Handbook. <laughs> That's the thick book na chem eggs usually. Oh, yung exams. Usually, professors cram it at the end of the term. So, <laughs> it's like when you start class, chill for first few weeks, and then exam, 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 exam. For major exams. Four long exams and then finals. So like five lahat. Expectations of egg life. It's not easy but it will be fun and it will be worth it. Not easy in terms of academics since you'd really be expected to work hard <laughs> But once the egg, are you expected to fail or be delayed? No. Once you're egg, I think in any course, you can get delayed. So, just like in egg, you can get delayed, but you can also not get delayed. It depends on your study habits and how you handle it. Struggles of SQL. Probably it's when you have several exams in a week, or sometimes when you have um, a lot of exams in a day. So, it's not just like one exam a day, but sometimes you can have exams in a day and then they're both different so maybe it's a struggle and you don't know which one to study paano na over study the basics of both and then just weigh which subject you're more weak on and then that's where you focus so that you can pass both subjects how to balance your time sometimes when you listen in class then there are some topics wherein you can skip when you study for an exam so example if you have a lot of things to study then just pick out the important ones and then study those. A lot of group projects in campaign. We have some subjects wherein we design an equipment. Let's say for our separation process a subject. Then at the end we had a group project on designing. It's either a liquid liquid extractor or distillation column. So something like that for our major subjects. And then another group project aside from thesis is our plant design. So it's what other people call their capstone project. So we design a plant from scratch to finish. How do you balance your org life and your academic Priorities. I think it's all about knowing your priorities. Since if you know that which one's important, then you have to do that. But then once you commit to an organization, you can't just let it. Since those commitments, um, there's a chain reaction with that. So, when you commit, you have to make sure that you can deliver your responsibilities. But then, don't let go of that. Coping up with the lectures, especially guys. I think when you're just being attentive in class, kaya no. What do you need to watch out for in like? I think for the props, it's inevitable that you get terror props sometimes. But it really depends on how you respond to that situation. And similar to the one you said, my classmates, I think it's present in all of us. So to the incoming freshmen, don't give up. Engineering is fun. It won't be easy. But then, for sure, after you graduate, it will be fun. So hashtag tiwala. Paanong fun yung egg? So maybe fun is not all about the subjects. It's more of the people you do. So treasure those moments because after you graduate, it will be easy. Thank you. Thank you.